Yo, you, yeah, you right there. You new? Subscribe, man. Ha <laughs> ha. Why you don't leave your feet until the shooter elevates? He went for that pump fake hook, line, and sinker. Now here's Young, and AI throws it down. This is a serious game clinching run they're on. They are just not backing off, and they're gonna close this one out in style. Now here's Young, and AI. Now here's Young, and AI. Now here's Young, and AI throws it down. This is a serious game clinching run they're on. They are just not backing off. And like, comment. <laughs> For AI, and he misses it off the right side of the rim. I'm on fire. Come on. I got to get something with it. Now, Randolph. Inside. Here's AI. Ooh, AI at me, it man. <laughs> it's been all one way inside. Here's AI. Ooh, AI is at me, it man. <laughs> inside. Here's AI. Ooh, AI is at me, it man. <laughs> Show your butt some love, man. <laughs> Baby. Yo, 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 uh, it's your boy AI coming at you from Fort Wayne, Indiana, uh, all by way of China and the Shanghai Bears. What's up to my people out there? What's up, Wei? What's up, Zhang? What's up, Coach? Hey, Corey Harris, I'm coming for you, man. <laughs> I'm not going to take it easy on you, but, man, we're going to have a good time. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be good. How was that? Not magic, but uh, it works. Be the fan, that's what they call me. What's good? What's good? What's good? Okay. Let's do this. Surprised you made it on time. Always on time, baby. Gotta make sure I'm ready to put on a show for the fans. I just figured your new PR guy have you doing a couple radio shows and TV shows this afternoon, talking oh, yourself up. Oh, man. Look who just rented a condo in your head space. Hey, look, if you're not careful, I might just buy the whole building. <laughs> okay, so you got jokes, huh? You ever get tired of hearing your own hustle? There it is. My first down payment. So it's all you now, huh? Just you and baby Zuckerberg? Zach's on all the mad ants, all right? This exposure's good for all of us. We all win. The mad ants aren't going anywhere. He needs to just focus on looks from the league. Everything else is a waste of time. So what, you think that he's going to help you with the scouts, no. too? I know he's going to help you. But you're in my way. Have you heard about Vlad? Nah, who's Vlad? The Romanian guy on the Nets. They just brought him over. Vlad D. Paler? I didn't see a Vlad on the roster. Their center. Andre Haji? Right, yeah, but uh, they call him Vlad D. Paler. Hey, man, don't sweat it, Howie. Whoever he is, we got this. Oh, you know something I don't? Yeah, yeah. I read up this morning on Wayne Hoops HQ. The block called us out, saying that the key to this game is neutralizing Haji. And the only way to do that is to get everybody involved, so that's what I'm going to do. Are oh, you looking to get a triple-double? <laughs> I'm looking to win, baby. <laughs> win. Yep. Welcome everyone to Fort Wayne, Indiana. We have another great G League matchup for you tonight between the Mad Ants and the Long Island Nets. I'm Blake Suniga alongside my good friends Tim Swartz and Brian Banifatemi. Tim, what do you make of this matchup? Well, we have some great stars to watch in this game as Marcus Young and recent addition AI will look to carry the weight against a very tough Long Island team. Yep. And we'll look to see how he adjusts to the G League. And of course, the Nets are led by the Romanian big man, Vlad the Impaler. He's the type of big man that can just take jump, over man. a game. A lot of storylines to follow Woo. this matchup. It should be a fun Aye. one. And for Long Island, Vlad is the star of the team. But to top to bottom, they have talent. Absolutely. They provide a tough matchup for teams because they can run so many sets from inside and out. Reminds me a little bit of how the Denver Nuggets are constructed. Yeah, great point, Brian. Oh. 
And the Mad Ants with possession. And Andre Haji gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. Yeah, that's a quick foul yep. to pick up here in the opening quarter. Pick him up. On the wing, AI. Down low, Haji with the steal. Not a very wise decision to try the entry pass. And not with a defender right there, ready to pick it. What you got? What you Kelsey, do? inside. Here's Joseph, deflected! Wow. And Paul Tatum, a Houston native, grew up in that area. And Tatum was a huge Rockets fan growing up. You talk to him and he'll tell you his love for the game all started with him watching his hometown team as a kid. Yeah, watching a little T-Mac, a little Yao Ming. Now here's Kelsey. Pass to Haji. Come on, do something, man. Do something. Nope, I'm right there, man. Tough D on the inside. Sure, this, sure, sure was sure absolutely ball. no easy access to the bucket when this fella's in the middle. To the paint. Shoot it. Here's Randolph. Thank Makes you. It off the glass. Once. He ran his man right into the screen to open up the lane to the hoop. Ball ball. Now here's Kelsey. They really want to find that igniter here. That's on, right, their offense come is ground to a standstill. Maybe you need to suit nah, up, Tim. Man, they need a spark. Going? Well, if you ever had the chance to talk to Paul Tatum about basketball, you can really oh. just tell how passionate he is about the game. You can pick any topic about the sport or any part of, of the game's history, and he'll chew your ear off about anything until the sun comes up. Pass to Haji. Come on, what you got? Over AI. Nope. I'm no right there, on man. The shot a bit long that time. My defense, baby. Four straight misses Shoot it. to start Shoot the it. game. Yes, thank Not you. Not looking good for them. Goes Dug back it. up. And the layup is man. up and in. Four or five shots have dropped for them already. Started. Not a bad way to get things started. Timeout called the Nets. He has to be frustrated by their lack of production offensively, and I can't blame him. Uh, they're getting the looks, but the shots just aren't falling. And it's at the point where this slump is going to take a mental toll on them. It's a good timeout to try to keep them from getting too discouraged. And yeah, they've gotten the looks, they've gotten open, but they, they just can't get them to fall. Now here's Kelsey. Pass to Haji. What you got? What you got? Huh? Huh? They Where you going? This? Where you going? It's nope. hauled in by Randolph. The Mad Ants leading. And when Young is on the floor, you know he is going to be a threat to score. Offense just comes so easy to Young, and he knows it. You hope he finds a way to expand Shoot his Shoot game. It. But uh, when you need a bucket, he is such a good Young option it, man. And AI gets it to go. Yeah, that right there, that's the type Boy, of hustle damn. coaches love. AI doing his best to make an impact on the glass. Now here's Kelsey. What you got? He's closely guarded. What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? Here's Haji. Nope. Shakes off the strong D and gets the bucket for two points. Fine. <laughs> Not a ton the defense can do. At times, Haji is an overpowering force close to the basket. And with Marcus Young, perhaps the first thing you notice about him is the killer instinct on the court. Young is a player that is always looking to exploit a weakness or to catch a defender slipping up. Sometimes he'll get too Come focused on. on that aspect of the game, but I'd say it's worked well for him so far. Kelsey with the ball. Pass to Andrews. Haji covered by AI. He's been wayward on just about everything he's put up Shoot in this period. It. Here's Tatum. That's in, and he found his range with that one. Now one for two. They're going on a nice little run here. And getting to the rack has been the key. They're getting point blank looks time and time again. Yep. Now here's Kelsey. Here's Haji. He gets that one. 
And with Vlad the Impaler, they really run the offense through him. Every set this team has makes the best use of having an elite center in the middle. Haji is a great presence on the floor, and it's no surprise they built the offense around him. Calderon can't get it to go. Man, come on. Solid job by the defense to get in his way as he was going up. Pass to Haji. And here is Andrews. Puts it up. That one wide left. That is such Shoot. a low percentage shot. Look, he's got to remember, he's got four teammates out there with him. He doesn't need to do it all by himself. Pass this is rock. a team game. Yeah. So as we end the first quarter, already a double digit ball game. Matt Ants ahead, leading by 10. And we'll get the second quarter underway on the other side of this break. Too easy. A lopsided first. And the Nets making a I change what? here. They're coming back. Pass to Campbell. Fresh. And for those of you just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Here's Odom. Oh, Off target back. from outside. Well, I'm not Come sure, on, Brian, Come on. if Come on. Uh, you it. caught Shoot the it. local news, Shoot but it. apparently some of the Madden players the played a pickup with some of the locals. Yeah, a sight to see for sure. I believe it was AI and Tatum in a two-on-two -two game. You know, small things like that are what makes this team so endeared in Fort Wayne. Yeah, they really love them out here. Now here's Odom. Here's Fresh. Shot clock at five. Odom's shot yeah. is off. Hard Somebody, work on the glass the once again, guys. Shoot it, shoot they put it. a lot of effort into their rebounding. And that interior play, mm. it's made a big difference in this game. One thing you have to admire about Coach Keller is his commitment to having the team stay involved with the community. When you create an atmosphere like that within a locker room and the surrounding city, you get more wow. than the sum of your parts. Wow. Keller inspires his players by really making what they do larger than the results on the floor. Now here's Kelsey. What you got? Here's Haji. It's hauled in by AI. <laughs> Now the Mad Ants with it. They held a 12-point lead earlier. Pass to Randolph. Boss. The high floater! And the head coach of the Mad Ants, Gordon Keller. He's a back-to-the-basics kind of coach. He's going to drill the fundamentals and accountability to this Mad Ants roster from the first whistle yeah. to the Come final on. horn. What you got? What now you got? here's Haji. Tough shot, tough shot. He should save oh, the fade no. away for when there's a Why defender. Slow? Shoot it. Tatum, yes. again for Wade. What passing, they are moving the ball without any thought, without any individual agenda. So yeah, it's hard not to appreciate all the points they've gotten off of assists today. Just a complete team effort. Haji, covered by AI. He scores for Tough only shot. the third time tonight. Now three for ten, trying to climb out of a hole. Tough and shot. the Mad Ants looking to have AI spend a lot of time on Vlad here. Well, these are the kind of games that the Mad Ants acquired AI exactly for. He gives them a great shot to at least slow down players like Vlad and gives <laughs> his team a chance to win. You can always depend on him to put that lead pass right on the money. Uh-huh. Two more, baby. Can I do it? And here is Nelson. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game for him. Pass to Haji. Haji, what you got? Over AI. And so we wrap up the first half. The Mad Ants on top, up by 12. And don't go away after the break. We'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. Okay. 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 Yep, I'm doing good.
Hello and welcome back. Third quarter just about to get going in what has been a runaway of a game so far. It's been quite a game for Randall. He's Randolph. been a very smart game I mean. offensively, looking for finding the gaps in the defense to get the best shot possible. Yeah, the way he played that first half, well, that's exactly what we're talking about when we talk about being efficient on offense. Yes. And the whistle blows as the basket counts nice. and a three-point play opportunity. One free throw coming up. And the free throw, no good. And Andre Hodgi, better known as Vlad the Impaler, he is a handful of a setup. Wow, nice. He does everything nice you back. want from a big man, including scoring, defense, and setting up other ay, 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 ay. My fault. Now Kelsey. Pass to Haji. What you got? What you got? From 20 feet out. Good jump. It's not gonna go for him. And Fort Wayne the other way now. And with Haji, as you mentioned, it is the ability to create for others that's so special. Very special, very skilled, very smart player. And you know, it's rare to see a player of his caliber last long down in the G League. And I just think it's a matter of time before he catches on with an NBA squad. You just know there are scouts here watching him play. Well, there's gotta be teams ah. that could use that kind of playmaking ability. Absolutely. One more. Now here is Nelson. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Good, good. To Come the on. middle. One. What you got? The fadeaway. Count it. Good. A it's confident scorer. When Haji is draining those mid-range Jays, it helps open the floor up for the rest of his team. Randolph with it. He's against Joseph. And AI <laughs> throws it down. And AI and the rest of the Mad Ants were involved uh, in some community work recently. They had a booth at the State Fair. You just have to love that the team is willing to take time and meet fans on an individual basis by having a booth at the fair. It just takes a day for the players, but goes a long way in developing ties with the community. Now a timeout called by Long Island. He's been aggressive in creating his own shot so far, but it hasn't been falling. Probably time for him to devote all that energy to getting other folks involved. And so it's Long Island with it. It's a 14-point game. And so it looks like the Nets will retain possession here. Oh. Oh. Into the third we go. Two minutes in now. Knocked loose. And Ooh. it's stolen by Madison. Jumps up. And the dunk by Bailey Madison. I mean, the D, they didn't even try to get back on the break. They Wouldn't did. have mattered even if they did. There's no way anyone was beating him to the bucket right there. Yep. Okay. And so it's Long Island with it. Now here's Russell. Pass to Haji. Over AI. Tried to make yes. it in, but he misses. The game plan, it needs to change if they're going to get out of this hole because uh, he is not helping their offense. Well, it has been said time and time again, but it doesn't make it any less true. The yes, state of Indiana loves their basketball. Nice. And it's one reason why a team like Ooh. the Mad Ants can have it? such a devoted fan base. Yes, it, it goes across the entire state. It's in everyone's DNA. And they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. they got to score. Here's Haji. Long Island, no good that time either. It hasn't been an easy quarter for him, offensively speaking. Yeah, it's my fault, man. I got, I got good Now defense, here's AI. Man. Haji covering. Rebound, Long Island. Uh. Fresh with it. To the left side wing. Pass to James. To the right side. Here's Haji. That one goes. Count it. A wonderful inside score. Really like an old school big man. You gotta like watching Haji do his thing down there. AI outside. Here's Trigg. Oh Deflected. my god. Oh my god. Haji what was that steal. doing? Now James. No luck on that one. 
Man, they're in complete control. Everything they're doing, it's been working out. Wow. AI outside. Trig. And the bucket counts, and he's on his way to the line to try to make it a three-point play. We're seeing some good ball movement out of them. Definitely. Ten of their last 12 points have come off assists. And he's got his first opportunity at the line here tonight. And the Nets making a change here. An interesting thing I heard about Trigg is that he didn't take up basketball until he was halfway through high school. He was actually a gymnast as a young athlete, but his body outgrew that sport. Now here's Russell. Soft touch off the glass. Give an assist there, not for a pass, but for the solid screen set on the inside that freed him up and made the layup possible. Howie Carter, not the most impactful player on the floor for the Mad Ants, but he <laughs> is a valuable member of the team. Oh, absolutely. He can give them a spark on occasion, but he's one of those glue guys. Fantastic chemistry with the rest of the team, and he just knows his role. Now, here's Russell. Stolen Ooh. by Carter. A one-on-one -on -one situation. Ooh. Shot from free throw range. They grab their own miss. <laughs> the rebound has gone off the chart to the guys. And that's the number one reason why this <laughs> game is out of hand right now. Exactly. Their lead is not surprising given their advantage on the glass. I'm a big baby. Now here's Russell. He's closely guarded. Pass to James. Out of bounds. It'll be Matt Ant's ball. At the end of the third quarter, a huge lead, and this one may already have been decided. Yep. The Mad Ants on top, running away with it. Yep. And after a quick break, we're coming right back with the start of the fourth quarter. And thanks again for joining us. We'll see what happens in the fourth. Can I get two per double? Four more answers. Here's Odom. Outside Andrews. Now here's Kelsey. Guarded by Young. You know how things get around here in Fort Wayne. When the Mad Ants play, the entire city pays attention. The whole city shuts down as they love to support their local G League chapter. Nice yes. pass, led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Uh -huh. Solid read from AI. When someone's open, he's good at getting it to them. Yeah. Outside Andrews. Kelsey. Over Young. Marcus Young with some nice D. And here is AI. Tatum outside. Back to AI. And he uses the glass on the layup. And of course, AI, a name that uh, might sound familiar to college hoops fans, had a good run, a big game in the Sweet 16, but uh, ultimately the team came up just short. Still showed some great potential in what was his final year. Now a timeout called by Long Island. And AI. Two minutes. Three more assists. Can I do it? And that one misses. And when Young is in control of himself, he's a special talent. Just a natural scorer who possesses a ton of confidence. Now good here's jump, Haji. Jump. And again, it's the Nets missing. Not gonna make it. Pass to Randolph. AI. Come on, you. Let this time we Come on. Now Calderon, defended by Fresh. Six on the shot clock. <laughs> and the dunk by AI. <laughs> A big lead becomes bigger. Uh -huh. They're playing with purpose, guys. And that goes for both <laughs> ends of the floor. They've been controlling the action dunk, everywhere. Just dominant. Now here's Odom. Pass to Haji. Give it to him. What you got? What you From got? the baseline. Nope. No right look there. on that one. And Fort Wayne the other way now. AI right side. Come on. 
Call their own with it. To the paint. AI outside. Now here's Young, defended by Fresh. Offensive rebound. A nice <laughs> shot by AI. Such a dominant force sometimes. It's fun watching AI catch fire and ride it for as long as possible. Yes, it is. Now Odom. Pass to Haji. To stop the run. And the layup is up wow. and in. Oh, that move. That's exactly yeah. why you don't leave your feet until the shooter elevates. He went for that pump fake hook, line, and sinker. Now here's Young. And AI throws it down. This is a serious game clinching run they're on. They are just not backing off. And they're going to close this one out in style. What a surge. Give them credit <laughs> just to, to finish this one off. Here's Odom. Pass to Haji. Over AI. And he misses it off the right side of the rim. I'm on fire. Come on. I got this on with it. Now Randolph. Inside. Here's AI. Ooh, AI hot me, it man. <laughs> it's been all one-way traffic here. Is they've really been lights out offensively. And there's no telling how big that lead's gonna get. It just keeps increasing. And there it is, the final whistle. Matt Ants win. Fantastic G -G, baby. performance from the team me. to defend the home court. They and there were standout me. stars tonight, sure. But I like the way that the whole team, everybody, aimed to slow up. Vlad the Impaler. That yep. was a key factor in Fort Wayne coming out with the win. Yep. Offensively, the Mad Ants seem to be gelling, and you can just see when this team is on the same page. And they gave us a peek of how deadly they could be on offense tonight. And that's about all she wrote, folks. For Tim Swartz and Brian Benefitemi, I'm Blake Suniga. Thanks for joining us on this presentation of G League Basketball. I look good. What's your name? You're working hard, right? Fighting? Yeah, but I keep slamming into this wall. Why? I don't know. I, I'm doing everything right. I'm, I keep my head down. I grind. But you're still hitting that wall. So climb over it. Find your way around it. Dig a tunnel underneath it. Do not think about this wall as a barrier. Think about it as a question. What's the question? When I was a little kid, I wanted a big sounding job, right? Just like everybody else. I wanted to be a doctor, lawyer, president. Astronaut. I wanted to be an astronaut. <laughs> right, right. But then I got older, and my heart told me something else. Words. I loved how they sounded when I gave them context, purpose. I knew I wanted to be great at it. And everyone <laughs> told me that it was impossible because of the barriers, right? I'm a female. Uh, the odds, the competition, I'd never be able to make it as a living. And unfortunately, they were right. Every single door that I knocked on was slammed in my face. But you knew they were wrong. I knew that I could write. But I had to think about why I was being rejected. What were my flaws? Regroup, rethink. You went over that wall. I built a ladder. So, what happened? Oh, uh, it all fell apart, and now I just troll around at carnivals looking for stuffed animals to complete my collection. Oh, right, see, that's impossible. Can't be done. <laughs> no, now I have a great career. And it pays me enough that it's my only job, and it continues to grow. I am a sports writer and owner of Wayne Hoops HQ. Wait, Wayne, that's you? <laughs> that's, that's amazing. I, I read you, like, all the time. I always thought you were a guy. Oh, okay, because girls can't write about sports. No, the exact opposite. I always thought it was written by a dude named Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm just messing with you. Okay. I get that all the time. 
Yeah, yeah, your piece about Ben Simmons' development as a passer, man, I read that like 50 times. Thank you. Yeah. I did feel like going out with you was kind of touchy territory and crossing a line, so I kind of wanted to see how this went before I told you about it. What I do is very important to me, so anything that could call that into question is a red line. Yeah, yeah, I totally get that. Uh, I want to get you something before you leave. Okay. What? Oh, no. Yeah, what is it? Oh. company, oh, on your no. walk home. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for this giant elf. No, you won't look creepy at all. Just tall guy, a stuffed animal. I know exactly where this is going. Yeah. Yeah. Where? <laughs> uh, rhymes with ash can. Yo, 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 uh, it's your boy AI coming at you from Fort Wayne, Indiana, uh, all by way of China and the Shanghai Bears. What's up to my people out there? What's up, Wei? What's up, Zhang? What's up, Coach? Hey, Corey Harris, I'm coming for you, man. <laughs> I'm not gonna take it easy on you, but man, we're gonna have a good time, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be good. How was that? Not magic, but uh, it works. Yeah, it works, works really well, actually. It's, um, it's real. It's unfiltered, you know? It's gonna give me something to cut into the gameplay so that people get to know the real you. Yeah, maybe, but I don't know, man. Like, I don't want to come off like I'm just trying too hard to promote me only. I want my game to speak first. Your game is gonna speak for you, man. I'm gonna speak for you. There's nothing wrong with having a couple oh. more voices in the room. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I was just standing there. I don't know what... <laughs> Look, hey. You gotta keep your wrist loose, all right? You're shooting too flat. <laughs> what do you care how I shoot? You're the one with the game coming up. I know, I know, I know. Look, one more time, okay? Wrist loose, elbow in. Woo! That's you never looking at it. Feels good, right? It does. Hey, so um, you think I screwed up with Nikki? What on that date? Yeah, I think that she thinks I'm nervous around her now since she's a reporter. Are you nervous? Psh, that's not me. Ice water veins, remember? It's not like she's in my head all the time or anything like that. Wow. It's the unflappable AI finally getting butterflies. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, man. It's just, it's kind of like what Paul was saying about the city. Like, I've had girlfriends before, but not like this. Something about her just makes me feel like I'm home. What? <laughs> we open on the two of you driving through Amish country. <laughs> You're going through one of those covered bridges. New idea. Yeah, you, you, you're wearing those hats and overalls. Yeah. You open it up on the two-lane blacktop. You see those rows of corn going by. She's looking at you, and you can see it in her eyes. You go, this is good, man. I can sell this. What are you doing okay. this weekend? All right, let's, let's reel it in, Zach. Let's reel it in. All right, let, let's, let's sell the game. OK, let's focus on the game. There's no line anymore, AI. It's all the same brand. You want to get to the next level? This is what you have Let's to do. Let's keep it at the game for now, okay, man? That's that's not enough. Well, it has to be, okay? For now? Fine. Yeah, for now. Fine for now, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he looks just like me, though. Ooh, everybody want me right now. Where am I going? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, that's it guys. That's all I got right now. You know the deal, man. Ha ha. Ha ha. Yeah. I'll see you later. About to take down, you already know. Get the fuck out of my face now. Yeah, you gotta go. Man, I'm on the chase now. Leave me on my own.